So, Rory, do you think you're going to get a taste of Europa League action tomorrow? Yeah, hey, you know, I'd like to. Um, you know, it, uh, I've not been involved in as many as I'd like. You know, you know, most of that's down to injury, to be honest. But um, no, you know, but you've got to understand. Um, you know, the, the, the manager wants to use the squad now. Um, and it's a bit different for us having to, having to do that, but um, you know it, it shows how far we've come. But uh, you know, I, don't, I think if you ask everyone in there, that they'll all want to play. But um, if you know, you've got to take the manager's decision and uh, and get on with it. I, I just couldn't. I've never had a muscle injury really um, like that before, and uh, I didn't know didn't know how to handle it. Really, you know how long how long it needed and. Uh, I came back twice too early, um, you know, and ended up uh, tearing it, tearing it worse. So uh, I've learned, but I've learned from that, and um, you know, it was frustrating at the time. But um, I'm over it now, and uh, starting to feel feel a lot better for it. Nice to see you pop up with a goal and an important win at the weekend. Yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a rare one, but uh, I got got one out the way early this year. So uh, <laughs> we'll see if uh, see if we can add to it any more to it. Um, you know, it was. It was hard going into the international break after after the Swansea game, um, you know, and you got two weeks to, to mull that one over, and uh, which, which wasn't nice. But um, you know, it, it was good to be at home, really, and uh, uh, against a very good side like Fulham, um, you know, who who beat us twice last year. But um, you know, thankfully we uh, we turned up this time, and, and you know, I thought we deserved to win. The new players that Stoke have brought in, do you think they've got the Stoke City mentality that Tony often talks about? Yeah, I think everyone can see. You know, they've they've already got that in them. You know, that um, you know most of them knew what we were about anyway. Um, you know, and t- to be honest, you know, you talk ninety ninety nine percent of pros are a good pros anyway. Um, you know, you get the odd one that uh, causes trouble and things, but. Um, again, you know the managers looked into to the players they signed, and uh, you know the, they've all come in and take taken on what, what's expected of them here, and uh, improved that and shown it on the pitch. And um, you know the you know there's, there's, there's not a bad thing to say about any of them, and uh, you know they're all at different sort of stages of the careers as well. You know, and there's a couple of older lads, there's, there's lads that have come in, that are, you know, aren't fully fit, um, and players that have, you know. Crouches sort of had to drop down again, um, as it were, from the, that top, you know, Tottenham who were in that top four, five bracket, um, but but wants to progress and get back in the England squad. You know, the manager sold sold me that this is where he wanted to be, and um, you know, a lot a lot of people um, when you go to clubs try and sell you the same thing, but um, you, you should, like you sense something's not not all to do sometimes, but. Um, you could see he was serious. You know, at, at that time we got some uh, some very good players into the team that was that was struggling in the championship at the time with uh, you know Salif, Lee, Henry, uh, Don Matteo, you know, players like that, which you know you probably wouldn't have thought at that time he'd have got in. You know, Patrick Berger came in um, for a spell, uh, so you could see that he was serious, and the chairman backed him, and the chairman's family backed him, um, and, and here we are today talking about. You're over. You know, you've got to be honest with yourself. Unless you're in that top four or five club bracket, you're not. You're not going to get this every every year, or you know, it might not be. Another, it might not be every ten years. You know, um, you know. I've, I've I've been in the Premier League for is it fourteen years now, for something, and uh, it's this is only my second season of of getting into into Europe, and. Um, is, there's that there's that bracket of clubs that you know aren't going to get this too often, um, and uh, you know if we're honest at the moment we're probably in that at this at this moment, but we're progressing to be to get in, into that bracket where we're we're challenging for the Europa just you know in in, in the league position side of it, but um, doesn't mean whether you're 90 as I say if you're 19 or 38 or 40, uh, you've got to make the most of it, and you know if you if you look at the games and. The away games we've played in in the competition this season, I think you'd see that we're uh, we, we're desperate to win and go through. Looking ahead to Arsenal, Rory, there's been a couple of ding dongs between Stoke and Arsenal over the last few seasons. Do you prepare for this game any differently than you would normally? It's 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 an, it's another game for us, uh, another very tough game. We know 
Uh, you know, that, that's not one of those sides that, uh, you know, if they finish out the top three or four, they're going to be disappointed. Um, uh, so that shows how, how good they are. Um, you know, the, I know, I know they've, they've lost a couple of players, unfortunately, but they're still a world-class side, a team full of internationals, and um, it's no different than, than going to Man United or Liverpool uh, or Man City. It, it, it's going to be... Um, such a tough game for us, but again, we've got to we've got to go there and uh, and, tr- and try and win a game. It's you know it's as simple as that. And the only way we're going to do that is is play the way we play. And uh, as I say, everyone's got to be at ninety five hundred percent to to even think about getting a result there. And if if you're carrying two or three players, you're not going to get the result. You're going to get you're going to get battered by a team that's um, that's as good as Arsenal. We've been in touching distance a couple of times. Um, you know, Arsenal last season. Um, you know, although we were probably battered on possession side of it, um, I can't remember too many chances. And you know, it, it was my fault for the goal I lost. Um, uh, so that what that sort of one mistake cost us the game. And uh, you know, it was heartbreaking coming in after such hard work and, and been the one to to have lost the game. But um, you know, usually when there's a goal, there's a mistake. Um, that's how how good this league is.